Hi everyone. So I hope your campaign objective is defined and you have a clear objective of what your goal is. What your campaign goal is and what you want to drive. Whether you want to have leads, whether you want to have traffic, whether you want to have your app installation, whether you want to engage your YouTube audience for your ad or you want to introduce your product or service to your audience. So uh, in this video we will be talking about what are the different type of ads uh, we have an option to run for. For example, if your ad campaign is defined, now we will be moving to further different type of ad. Basically there are three type of network campaigns, search campaigns, display campaigns and video campaigns. So we will be understanding about all these three type of campaigns and we will understand what type of ad to use uh, for your uh, good convergence. So let's have a look into my sphere and understand the different type of ad and their use. So in last video we have uh, talked about our campaign objective. So once uh, your campaign objective is defined, uh, we can proceed with our campaign type. For example, what type of ad we want to proceed with. So there are basically eight options. Sorry, there are basically nine options. Options are like, for example, search ads, performance max, display ads, shopping ads, video ads, app ads, smart ads, local ads, discovery ads. So as we have defined our campaign objective, for example, like we are proceeding with leads. So as as I'll be showing you how to uh, as I'm showing you how to create an ad, I'm actually going to create an ad so that it will be helpful for you. So you can track me down that how I'm gonna create an ad, how I'm gonna analyze the keywords, how we'll proceed with that. So you will have a complete layout of from starting from scratch to making a successful ad campaign. So but let's understand the basic interface interface first. Okay. So when you will be clicking on the objective, you will be getting different options. For example, like if you click on the sales and if you uh, if you continue with the ad, there are options like search ads, performance max ads, display ads, shopping, video, discovery. But if you click on leads and again continue, there are search, performance, display, shopping, video, discovery. Okay. Then we click on website. There are again the same five options, six options: search, performance, display, shopping, video, discovery. But now, when we'll con when we'll click on product and brand consideration, we'll only be having an object of video ads. So this is for the ads we uh, we'll be running on YouTube to engage our viewers to get in front of new audience. So this is the ad type we get in the product and brand consideration campaign objective. Let's check in brand awareness and reach. So here are two ads: display ad, video ad. Basically, in Google Ads, there are three type of network campaigns. Search ads, display ads, video ads, and in these three categories, all these ads are uh, are the sub uh, all these three. Oh, sorry, in these three categories, all these sub uh, all these ads are included. So in search ad, basically these are the text ads. For example, like let's have let's check once. When we search for Google Ads experts, so see. This the ad. This is a search ad. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's check here. Or if you have, uh, you may have visited a lot of website before also. So if uh, when you see an ad between a blog or on any of the website, maybe it, it can be or the header, footer, or any of uh, any of the space. But if you uh, when you visit a website, when you are looking uh, for something, you are just grabbing the knowledge or content so if their ad comes like this this is a display ad with the image the text with the image so this is display ad earlier previous one was the text ad display ad we need to uh, we need to provide the google with the particular dimensions image and with that text so that when someone looks for something a display ad uh, sorry so these display ads are in between of for example like uh, the content the blog the news website these are on the google search partners so when we will be running an ad and when we have the audience that is uh, showing some interest according to our keywords or our uh, audience selection, Google will uh, track down them over the web. So where uh, when they will be visiting any of the uh, search uh, website of uh, uh, the when whenever the people will be uh, going around on the website and if the website is registered, registered for the Google Ads, sorry Google AdSense. If it's uh, or the website is the part of Google Search Partners network, sorry. So uh, we'll be we'll be tracking them tracking them down. 
so we are going to follow them we are going to look for them and uh, we'll be just popping up there in front of them because they have shown interest in our ad or the product or service we are providing third is the video ad video ad basically comes uh, in the our uh, youtube ads sorry youtube so when there is a short video of uh, the skippable option or the in-stream option so that video ad that is uh, that video that comes uh, when we are when we are so, uh, when we are just uh, using the youtube or when we are watching any of the youtube video and when the uh, ad comes in front of us that is the video ad so basically they, these are the three network campaigns and all these ads come and all these types of ad comes under the three ad camp three network campaigns so when we click on app promotion we have only the option of app drive app promotion across google network when we click on the local store visits and promotion we are having option of performance max and local let's understand performance max ad is like uh, google will ask you it's a mixture of search ad and video ad sorry search ad and display ad so google will ask you for three to four types of ad he'll ask you for a text ad a, a banner also and he'll just uh, rotate the ad around around your uh, selected audience randomly and will help you in getting inside that which ad is performing good or he'll rotate the ads accordingly to get you the best conversion rates so it is the performance max ad it uh, runs across the uh, google search partners or the web and it just uh, show the ad randomly according to according to the insights or the behavior of audience and uh, give you the best uh, the conversion rate it helps you in generating the best conversion rates so it's a mixture of three to four ads that google automatically rotate and show to the different type of audience and give you the best data so that uh, you can kill up the best performing ad. this is an option for local ad drive customers to a physical location for example if someone is searching for doctor near me so our uh, our clinic address or our clinic will be popping up there and from there he can just look over the address and uh, come to our clinic so this is uh, this is basically used for when you are uh, when you are targeting a local area and you want a people to drive to a physical location or if you want to you want people to come to your office or physical location now as we have already checked the create a campaign without a goals guidance so in this when we click on this option basically we are proceeding with with our choice that we don't want to uh, go with the basic campaign objective which google ad is giving us when we click on the create a campaign without a goals guidance all all options of the ads type will be uh, will be there for you for example like search performance max display shopping video app smart local discovery so as search ads let's start with the search ads search ads are like text ads like when we uh, look for some when we for example like if we are looking for google ads expert This is the search ad. These are the search ad that people have targeted for the this key. This is the performance max ad. This is a mixture of ad. For example, it's a, it's a it's a uh, package of search ad and display ad, which Google automatically um, randomly shows to different type of people to get the best results for you. This is the display ad, like I've already shown you. This is the display ad. Shopping ad, uh, for example, like if you are looking for the, let's check it here. This is are these are the shopping ads. Ads. These are the shopping ads. If you have any product and if you if you are an e-commerce website, if you have an e-commerce website and you wanna want to uh, sell out those products, you can choose this ad out. This is the video ad. This uh this is shown for the YouTube like if you have uh, if you when you visit a, when you see a youtube video and the ad comes in between or if there is a skippable ad or in stream ad this is the option which you click this is the app promotion ad this is used for app installs engagement or app engagement this is smart ad so it it it's similar to the performance max ad uh, it helps you uh, reaching to the uh, variety of audience with multiple ads so that you can track down which ad is performing best and you can proceed with it so it's a, uh, it's like Google will ask you for the multiple headlines, multiple copies, multiple, uh, multiple text, sorry, description, and it will just uh, rotate them around and uh, will help you in getting the 
best insights for the best ads so that you can check which which headline is performing which description is performing which title is performing how these ads are performing how people are responding to the ads extension this is the local ad when we when we are targeting a physical location and when we want people to visit to our local store this is the option for discovery ad uh, basically we use this option for when you want to uh, promote our products or service on youtube home watch or gmail promotions so this uh, this gives an option and the flexibility of promoting our ads or services on uh, youtube home uh, the watch option the gmail promotions and a lot more these were the uh, these were the uh, information or the introduction of what are the different types of ads where they are used and what they actually mean so this will help us in selecting our ad type and proceeding with creating a successful ad campaigns